Hello guys, welcome to Amit Things. In this video, we will see how we can easily download and install PyCharm ID on Mac. So for that, first we need Python. So we have installed Python. Go to the Spotlight search. Let us verify. Type terminal. Click on it. Now let us type Python 3 hyphen hyphen version and press enter. You can see we installed Python 3.9.6, which is the current version. If you don't know how to install Python on Mac, you can refer the link in the description of this video. So we have installed Python successfully. Now we need to install PyCharm. For that, go to the browser. We have reached the browser here and type PyCharm. Press enter. On pressing enter, you can see the official website is visible. JetBrains.com. JetBrains owns PyCharm. Click on it. Now here in you can download. Click on download. Now you can see the version for Mac was automatically highlighted. Here in you can see it got highlighted. Professional version and community version is visible. Community one is completely free and open source, so we will download the same. Click on download to download it. Now the download should start. Here in you can see it's 480 MB. You need to wait for a few minutes. So guys, we have installed the DMG file of PyCharm for Mac. Now double click on it. Minimize this. Now you can see you need to drag this here. You just take this and drag this under applications. That's it. Now you can see under applications PyCharm is visible. Double click on it. Click here. Yes, I want to open it. Now the installation started. I confirm that I accept the agreement. This is the agreement. You can read this. Click on continue. Data sharing, you can send it. Now it will start. PyCharm 2021.2. Now you can see we have started PyCharm. So herein you can create your new project straight away. I'll click on new project. Here and it is asking for the name of your new project. Here and you can see I have mentioned this name. You can also change it and let's say I'll give the name Amit project. Here it is asking for interpreter new environment. So this is very crucial. It automatically took the Python 3.9 path which I've shown that where we installed Python. It automatically took this path. I was having multiple paths like Python 2.7 also, but it took Python 3.9. You can change from here, but mine is completely fine. So I have set the environment. This is why Python installation is important before installing PyCharm. Okay, so you need nothing. You can create a welcome script. I'll just uncheck it because we are creating a sample, a basic project. So here in you can see the path. It's under users amid PyCharm projects. So your our project will get saved here. I'll just copy this path. Users amid PyCharm project from the desktop you can straight away go click on go go to folder and you can paste this path here here and you can see so this is our PyCharm projects folder click on go and you have reached here you can see it will now create it now I'll just click on create and it will create it So herein we have created it. You can see now the path you can see the same. It's the same. You can right click and straight away create a Python file. Let's say my name of the file is demo dot. You don't need to mention the extension because we straight away clicked on creating a Python file. So I'll just type demo and press enter. Here it is. Now it has created a Python file. Now let us run something quickly. Let's say I type Amit things. That's it. Now I'll just go to file and save all. Now to run it, I'll just right click on the I'll just right click on the file and click on run demo. And you can see we successfully ran our first Python program. So this was our program. I'll minimize this. Now you can see un under our path, I told you PyCharm project, we created Amit project. This is the folder and this is our demo.py file. Here it is. You can see demo.pf file, py file. If you'll open this, let's say I'll open it under text edit, the same small code will be visible. 
so you can straight away set PyCharm here by right clicking and keep in doc it will get saved here now so guys in this video we saw how we can download and install PyCharm for PyCharm we need Python so we downloaded and installed PyCharm successfully we also ran our first program by creating our first project on Python on PyCharm so guys thank you for watching the video if you liked it do subscribe to our channel Amit Things.